What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Tony Smiles here with some breaking news. Today, we're diving deep into the heavyweight division. Make sure to subscribe to at JV underscore entertainment on YouTube for more boxing, sports, and entertainment news. In a surprising turn of events, Oleksandr Yusik, the undisputed heavyweight champion, has decided to gift his IBF title to his former opponents, Anthony Joshua and Daniel Dubois. This move has set the stage for an electrifying showdown on September 21st at Wembley Stadium. But is this act as generous as it seems or is there more to Usyk's decision than meets the eye? Usyk, with an impeccable record of 22 and 0, including 14 knockouts, has made it clear that he's planning to vacate the IBF title. His true goal? To move back down to cruiserweight and become a two-time undisputed champion in that weight class. Usyk's announcement on X, formerly known as Twitter, has created quite a buzz on social media. While some see it as a magnanimous gesture, others argue it's more of a strategic move. By vacating the title, Usyk can focus on his cruiserweight ambitions. For Anthony Joshua, the prospect of fighting for a title essentially discarded by his conqueror raises questions about pride and validation. Joshua, who has faced significant challenges in his career, including two defeats to Usyk, is now in a position where reclaiming the IBF belt seems necessary for his self-esteem and career trajectory. The IBF title holds strategic importance for Joshua, who boasts a record of 28 and 3 with 25 knockouts. This title facilitates his fight with Daniel Dubois, who has a record of 21 and 2 with 20 knockouts. Without this title, Joshua might have considered other opponents like Jile Zhang or Joseph Parker. Now, the stage is set for Joshua and Dubois to face off on September 21st at Wembley Stadium in London. This fight is crucial for both fighters, not just for the IBF title, but for their careers and reputations. Looking ahead, the implications of Usyk's decision extend beyond Joshua and Dubois. If Usyk emerges victorious in his rematch against Tyson Fury on December 21st and subsequently vacates the remaining belts, the winner of the Joshua-Dubois fight may have to chase after the other three titles. This scenario sets up a potentially fragmented heavyweight division, with fighters scrambling to unify the belts. Usyk's decision can also be seen as a strategic move to unsettle Tyson Fury. Fury, who was eager to fight for the undisputed championship and cement his legacy, now finds himself deprived of that opportunity. Their rematch on December 21st in Riyadh will no longer be for the four belts, at least for the moment. This development could play on Fury's mind, adding another layer of psychological warfare to their bout. As the fight between Joshua and Dubois approaches, the stakes are high. Both fighters have much to prove, and the IBF title, though handed down in an unorthodox manner, adds weight to their bout. For Joshua, this fight is a chance to reclaim a piece of his former glory and assert his place in the heavyweight division. For Dubois, it's an opportunity to rise in the ranks and make a name for himself. The boxing community is eagerly awaiting the outcome of this clash, which promises to be a defining moment for both fighters. The September 21st bout at Wembley Stadium will be a spectacle, drawing fans and pundits alike to witness the unfolding drama. In the meantime, all eyes will be on the rematch between Usyk and Fury on December 21st. This fight carries significant implications for the future of the heavyweight division. Usyk's tactics and Fury's response will shape the landscape of boxing in the coming months. Oleksandr Usyk's decision to gift the IBF title to Anthony Joshua and Daniel Dubois has set the stage for a series of high-stakes fights. While it may appear as a generous gesture, it is laced with strategic intent and psychological maneuvering. The upcoming fights will not only determine the holders of the titles but also redefine the dynamics of the heavyweight division. Hey YouTube, don't forget to like and subscribe to at JV underscore entertainment on YouTube for all the latest in boxing, sports and entertainment news. Hi everybody people, Anthony and Daniel, listen, I know IBF title important to you, tell it my present to you on September 21. Guys, Slavo Bozov, Slavo Ukraini.